Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another exclusive interview here on Gamecock Central. I am Kendall Smith, joined alongside of Judge Collier. He is one of the newest commits in the class of 2023 for the University of South Carolina out of Legion Collegiate Academy in Rock Hill, South Carolina. So just down the road from Columbia, and Judge, congratulations on your commitment what has life been like for you over the past week or so since you committed? Um, it's been it's been great. Uh, I mean, you get the uh, the recognition, especially in Rock Hill, with uh, that being we call it Football City USA, and a lot of our guys like just like the big names, Clowney and Gilmore, coming out of Rock Hill and going to South Carolina. So, because everywhere you go, people know who you are. So it's been it's been it's been night and day from when I wasn't committed to now where I am. So I want to ask you some more fun questions, some more personality-based questions, uh, so that way our fans can get to know you a little bit better. So, Judge, who would you say your biggest football inspiration is? Right, like, as far as, like, who I play the game after? Yeah, like, who do you, like, think inspires you the most in terms of how they play and, like, how that translates into your game? Um, I like uh I like Jeremy Chen a lot. He plays for the Panthers. He's a he's their safety. I like Jeremy Chen. I like to play my game after him. He's uh physical. He's not a built the same, big, long. So uh I I like to play my game after him. So you obviously spend a lot of time on the football field, practicing, getting ready for the season now with it being July, but when you do get a free moment and you get some free time, what do you like to do in your off time, Judge? Um, I like to I like to play basketball. Typically, okay. what I play would be basketball or track, but uh, we have low hoop sessions that we have uh, in the neighborhood, or get the, get the guys together and we'll play. But uh, yeah, if it's not football, it's basketball. So uh, you're probably excited to get to South Carolina then. Who put some of the guys on the team and uh, see what they got? Because I know they're very competitive. Like they play golf against each other, basketball, just the whole nine yards. When they're not playing football, you got to be competitive doing something, right? Right, right, right. So Judge, you're from South Carolina and you've spent a lot of time in the Palmetto State. So with it being summer and everybody going on their beach trips, what would you say your favorite beach in South Carolina is? Um, I mean, everybody knows Myrtle Beach, so, I mean, everybody goes there, senior week is always down there, so, I mean, it's just, it's a fun place to be, and uh, you got you got your friends, so I'd say Myrtle. If your parents tell you that you're going out to dinner, you're going to a restaurant some night to eat, what is your favorite restaurant that you like to go to? I like Fireburgers. Yes. Oh, I went there the other night. It is so good. What's your go-to meal there? I like I like the uh, appetizer, the uh, the crab dip or the yeah with the chips. I like that. That's good. I can sit there and just eat that. So. So you're a seafood guy. Yeah. Big, big seafood. Guy. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Seafood, yeah. so good. If people say they don't like it, I'm like, you haven't given it a fair shot because it's amazing. Yeah. Are you a sushi person then? Do you I like? Sushi? I don't mind it. I like. Okay. I don't like like the like. I like the ones with crab in them. The ones okay. With yeah yeah the raw fish is a little iffy uh speaking of iffy food and bizarre food I've asked every recruit every player every commit that I've talked to about their weird food combinations that they like to eat so like Braden Davis does quesadillas and ketchup it was inspired by Will Levis who does coffee and mayo together so do you have a weird food combination judge that you like to eat um I won't say it's weird I just say it's something that I don't see a lot of people doing like when I eat um, watermelon I do put salt on my watermelon okay I have never tried that but people swear by it they say it's really good yeah but do you no, uh do you do pineapples stuff. on pizza yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like pizza. yes Zabari Sandy does that too I feel like that's a big toss-up like People are very passionate about whether or not they do pineapples on pizza, but I'll have to try a, I'll have to try salt with my watermelon because I've heard it's really good. So, uh, Judge, what is your message to Gamecock Nation ahead of coming to South Carolina? What are you going to bring to the table for this football team when you get there? Um, bring me. I'm bring my athletic ability. Me as a person. 
person, me as an athlete, and hopefully we, uh, this 2023 class and everybody else that comes behind us, we can, uh, we can compete. We're going to compete. We, uh, we're going to look forward to uh, knocking off the big dog and making the SEC championship and going on to win bigger things. So I'm excited. You all heard it there from Judge Collier, one of the newest commits in the class of 2023 for the University of South Carolina. Again, congratulations, Judge, on your commitment. Super excited for you, and we look forward to keeping up with you throughout your senior season as you uh, get through that and then come on down to South Carolina. Yeah, it would be down. Down from Rock Hill to Columbia. I always struggle with the geography. It's hard to tell, but we're excited for you. Thank you.